Right, so we're a bit dark. There we go. Um, first clip. I've parked at Oakhampton train station and I'm setting off along the Granite Way. Squirrel. But um, yeah, already made a wrong turn. Fucked up. Didn't look at the map properly. Went up a steep hill. Had to come back. But anyway, I think I've sussed out how the commute thing works now because I've never used that before. But yeah, so far it's all right. Nice. It's long, smooth, steady uphill. I'm sure it's going to get much fucking worse. I'm already. Uh, <laughs> already a bit doubting myself a little bit but I'm sure I'll be fine but weight of the bike feels all right a bit heavier than usual backpack's not too bad but um yeah we'll just see how it goes and I'll uh, maybe do a couple of videos as we go see if there's anything a bit more interesting to look at other than just the path I'm sure there will be but yeah here we go all right so at the end of that long I don't know how long that was like how long was that three miles I just started up that nice thing but now going on to the, over the I can't remember what the name is it something viaduct it's all part of the granite way big dam over there so I guess I'm kind of starting to get out into it proper now but yeah let's go all right I'm still going up so we're at 1150 feet now it's the first climb so I think I'm almost at the top of it go right, lads but, um, so yeah I moved off that nice single track now and into nice grass which isn't too boggy or anything so and that's where I'm going up there I guess but yeah so I've opened up opened right up now getting into the clouds yeah here we go now we're going right first uphill bit done so just in this uh, kind of a open whatever this mall on I guess so Anyway, since this is going to be on the internet and it might be more than my mum and dad just watch it, so this is my first ever time backpacking, first ever time on Dartmoor, so it might go alright, <laughs> it might not, we shall see. But I've got some get out plans, so I'm sure it'll be fine. So, uh, yeah, my only problem so far is my bag that was supposed to turn up didn't turn up, so I just had to improvise and ratchet strap it. Uh, just a normal dry bag on there but it seems alright so it's catching a little bit but not too much so not gonna be I'm not gonna be fucking flying downhill too much so anyway I shall uh ooh, right better concentrate a little bit don't want to crash this early on <laughs> ooh, let me get around that what are we saying Boggy, 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 not got my camera in the right place. Ow! Dickhead. So, headwind's still pretty uh, persistent, but it's alright. It's flattened out a little bit now, so I'm still up here. I think I've got a bit of downhill now, so I'll um, do, do this. There we go. Right, that was the first check to see. Uh, make sure everything stays on the bike, I suppose. Let's have a look. Shitty seat bag thing. Yep, still attached. Tent pegs still there. Loads of shit all over the water bottle, but that's just my filter one, so I won't be putting my lips on that cow shit. And then, yeah, everything else is there. Right, I'll, uh, shall continue onwards. Ooh, there we go. I'm going uphill again. There's a bridge. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I should probably put both hands on handlebars. <laughs> the gate, a lot of gates. I guess there's going to be a lot of gates in there, a lot of sheep, a lot of cows. Oh. A lot of gates.
Ooh. More fields, more uphill. Rocked up again, I was going to be a long time at this rate. I went through that gate up there and up that hill. Didn't need to do that. I need to come through this gate here and then along this nice path that's not up a hill. <laughs> it's a learning experience, we'll be fine. Oh, so, right, I've been a nice cycle. I don't know what cycle way this is. Don't know. Don't know. Anyway, just follow, blindly follow the map. But anyway, it's quite nice. Right through a few miles. And uh, stop some lunch because I'm not eating yet today. I'm getting a bit peckish already. And it is, what time is it? 10.41 and no food yet. So. But yeah, this is a this is a nice respite. <sighs> right, so that last bit that was, that was on was called the was the Granite Way. Here's what that cycle path was again. So went on that, which was nice for quite a while, and then uh, it was just down onto some just roads through some villages and stuff, which was good. Like a bit of a break, and then now I'm back out in this, and uh, so it's more of this kind of grass stuff which is all right there's a few little streams here and there it's not that wet it's not that bad to to pedal on but um no, it's gonna i've still got to stop and eat i'm fucking getting really hungry now so i keep waiting for a nice nice spot to enjoy me vegan sausage roll but um i've got this guy coming up here so we'll, uh, we'll see what he's got to say see if he knows um if there's any good spots anyway what are you guys saying i'll give you a wide berth i shall not uh, disturb you laying down Anyway, good to sit and have some food. No, nah. right. I'll have a look. All right, I shall carry on on this for another, well, I don't know. I guess this is it for a while now. It's just uh, more of the single track, but it's all right, it's pleasant, pleasant enough. Got some food. I was trying to look some rocks or something just to get me out of the wind, but I found a, a, a bush. So that shall be my, uh, that shall be my scoffing spot. But, uh, Oh. Yes, he's starving. Oh, but I've done uh, what we're on now. Oh, no. Nearly 13 miles in two hours. So, yeah, basically, this loop. Oh, we down, we down, we down. So, oh, fucking nice as shit, isn't it? Look at that. There we go. Right, so yeah, so this loop I think is uh, 84 kilometers. Got it from a book by uh, I don't know, Emily, Emily Knightson or something like that. I don't know anyway. So that had the, the route in there, so I'm sort of basing it on that. So I don't know, I'm going to try to do it in two days, but that depends if I can do 40 miles today. I don't know, I'm not particularly bike fit to be honest. Or if not, I can do it in three. But um, yeah, we'll just see how it goes. But anyway, but. So I'm gonna have me a uh, Morrison's fucking slightly grotty thing, and then crack on again. But not a bad spot, is it? Not bad. Oh, just, oh, come down through some more like just roads and stuff like that, and villages, which are really nice. And uh, have a little little wooden bridge now. It's like it's going down some uh, bridleways and single track and stuff. So yeah, what we're on now, so 15 miles in. But weather's still holding. Looks like I've just missed a load of rain. But, um, yeah, carry on. Been a bit more roads and stuff, and I've come up like side of a Methodist church or a village, and then uh, yeah, got some good stuff to get over. And, um, yeah, it looks like I got a big old climb next though. But oh, lovely, lovely stream, little path up the side of it. More uphill. Okay, so that climb I was talking about, fucking. <laughs> quite savage still going on I, think, I don't know if you can see it on the little fucking the little thing here this little steep one here is what i'm going up so it's almost vertical on that anyway i think i'm like it must be nearly there now but we'll see but um yeah i pedaled a bit of it but it's just fucked absolutely fucked but anyway it's all part of the fun i suppose nearly at the top top some more food in a bit still hungry right, made it to the top of that fucking hill and another couple of hills so um yeah, just some farm paths now, and look at them, some nice old trees. Um, yeah, a bit more farm paths and stuff now. These are alright, pretty rocky and that, but not so bad. And then maybe I'll get to do some flat or some downhill at some point soon. Looks like I'm at the peak of a thing now, so 
hopefully get a little, little rest from going uphill. Yeah. Yeah, I was, I was there. I was well wrong. I'm still, still going up fucking hill. I still got that. Oop. Still got to go up there, I think. Oh, I think that's where I'm going. But, I mean, it looks nice. But, yeah, I guess that's part of it. Right, I'll, uh, maybe I'll check back in when I'm at the top where I can have a, uh, what have I got? A track bar. So, uh, yeah, well, it's a nice, got a nice area. Look at that. That's the right views. It's fucking windy, though. And uh, a lot, a lot of cycling going on at the minute because it's still uphill and it's this like old, um, some sort of medieval fucking lumpy path, but it's dry, so that's good. Um, so yeah, fucking pretty tiring, but I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just coming up to 19 miles, which I mean, it's probably too windy. Can you even hear me? Who knows? Let's see what the GoPro's doing. But um, that's what I want. Who also, also up there? Is that a Dartmoor pony? Can't see it with the GoPro, but um. No, so I wanted to do 40 miles today, so I'm on track for that. I've still got plenty of time, so fingers crossed. I might get it done in two days. We'll see. I don't know. It might get even harder yet. Who knows? So, but having a nice time though. So, all right. Okay, so I'm, again, very windy. Can you hear me? Who knows? I don't know. The microphone's all right on this, so we'll see. I made it to my first uh, big pile of old rocks. Look at that. Well worth. Uh, 20 miles of off-road stuff. Oh, well good though. Ah. Um, yeah. I think whenever I see anything like this, it's just like, oh, it's like Brim and Rocks, but not as good. But <laughs> for me, that's the, uh, the uh, growing up in Yorkshire thing. Still, quite an impressive lump of rocks, nevertheless. Maybe I'll, uh, I'll climb up on top of it, because that's another thing that you do, I suppose, isn't it? Get a good view. Okay, I'll climb up some rocks. Uh, climb up, that'd be good. Just fall, uh, fall off something out here. That'd be all right, lads. I'm sure someone will come around eventually, wouldn't they? a big pile of rocks and I shall continue riding to more big piles of rocks. Down off the uh, off the Dartmoor now, well off around where all them tours and that were, and onto bridal path, uh, bridal ways and that again now. So beautiful scenes and uh, lovely mossy rocks, and then these are probably going to be well. Can I paddle up them? Let's have a go. See how fucking horrid it is. Yes, yes, yes. But um, yeah, it might be, it might be slightly. Oh yeah, te technical, very technical. But um. Fuck! <laughs> Let's go. Alright, I might cycle. Let's not try and film. Right, but yeah, lovely mossy rocks, lovely woodland. Oh, we're still in some woods. It's a bit less slippy, so I can actually ride it. Sun's actually peeking through the trees there. So, um, yeah, a lot of this, it's kind of like. <laughs> Whee! At least it's interesting to ride. But, um,. Not the fastest going, but I ain't in a rush of mine, so it don't really matter, I suppose. I think I'm, well, I'm well over 20 miles now, so well on to where I want to be. But yeah, ancient old little woods. Fantastic. Whoa, slippy rocks. But um, yeah, brilliant so far.
flying them out. This would be great if you didn't have all the weight on your bike, your bike you could fly down here, but also I don't want to risk fucking my bike at, uh, at this stage because I think I'm a bit out there. Great though. And the sun's actually come out finally as well, so hopefully it stays out for the day. I, mean, I can see some ominous clouds, but you never know. <sighs> Got it all in it, fucking big grassy bits, rock gardens. Me again, I've just been pushing up another fucking massive hill. <laughs> anyway, back in the, uh, into the centre of Dartmoor again, I think, I guess that's right. Another big pile of rocks over there, it's nice, I'm not going to bother going looking at it because I've seen one pile of rocks. I don't think it's worth the effort. So, um, yeah, there's this nice sort of farm single track now. This bit looks like it's going downhill a little bit, which would be a nice treat. Still got a headwind though. But, um, not raining, I mean it looks a bit bleak over there, we'll see, so, but so far my thoughts on backpack, bike packing, heavy bike, a little bit cumbersome, nearly fell off a couple of times, but just got to go slow, um, yeah, good, I'm having a nice time I think, so, um, yeah, what we are now, we're uh, 24 miles about, so, um, yeah, if I make it to 40 today, then I can find somewhere to start looking somewhere to camp and have one of my delicious uh, freeze-dried meals and stuff. So, yeah, but no, it's all, all good so far. See in a bit. Oh, good. Yeah. Well, my first trip, tr still, still a headwind. But I think I've got a couple of ponies, first ones on the moor, so we'll see if they, how chill these guys are. We'll go slow. How are we doing? Are we chill? Oh yeah. What are you saying? You're a beauty. Yeah. They're all right. So if number three is a chill guy, also. Oh sorry. I'm hoping I'm doing like it's a loop. I'm doing so mate, and so I do forty today. Hopefully tomorrow's 40, we'll maybe have the wind behind me. That'd be a treat. Hey buddy, on your left. Yeah, it's the wildlife so far. It's good wildlife. For another uh, flapjack break. I think I'm in a massive calorie deficit, says the, uh, the watch anyway. But um, anyway, lovely granite bench. Hell of a view on it though. But, um, yeah, nice little stream running all the way along. Don't know what that pole is there. Uh, Shoot and have a look. Have a look. Uh, I'm fucking knackered. Mm. 26 miles. Hmm. It's been quite slow going. I guess, yeah, just a lot of pushing the bike and stuff. Still been good, but. Crusty old pole? Don't know. Anyway. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. The light's a bit shit. Hmm. I shall continue on after I've had my flapjack. And um, if I see anything else interesting, I'll get the camera on. If I don't, I'll just continue pedaling till the camping time. Uh, I thought I'd check in, I'm at 30 miles now. It's been really early. I mean, I, sh I should have known it was going to be heavy, but so I'm back up on top of the hill again. At least I've got some some uh, uh, tarmac stuff to go on. But um, yeah, I'm pretty fucking drained, to be honest. But, uh, <laughs> I'm already having thoughts about how I can get back to the car quicker, but we'll see. I'll, um, might be alright once I've once I've had a once I've had a uh, fucking hang on change gear. Oh. 
don't know, it was cold. Once I've had some food, another camp, and that will see how I feel tomorrow. But I think I can always, instead of doing like a full off road day tomorrow, just go back up roads because that's been fucking brutal. It's been like proper, like rock garden. I mean, it's been great, but I think maybe split this over three days or something. But an adventure in it but fuck yeah some of them like proper rock guy if you like didn't have a like any stuff on your bike it'd be great you could fucking fly down it but yeah right anyway pedal on all right quite despondent stuff i had to walk up that back there because it was steep but it's okay just so yeah fucking incredible scenes though there's nothing i think i am going to yeah i'm out there now yeah Pretty hungry, pretty tired. We tried doing another 10 miles to camp, but we get to 5 miles and the bed is grumbling and I see somewhere nice to camp. We'll do that. So. Right on. Oh, hey, it's me again. I'm still walking up hills. Yeah, it's nice. It's like a. I guess it was a little village or, or a little hamlet at some point. There's all loads of. My battery went dead when I was telling a fun story about this stuff. But anyway. Some ruins, some cows, that's the gist of it. And I think my camera will go off at any second now. Right then, so I got like 38 miles done today. I'm, I'm fucked, absolutely fucked. I, went, I was, my plan to camp was a bit further on, but I was just done and I saw this bunch of spiky stuff and it was kind of flat. I was like, what I'll fucking do for the night. So why are you not focusing? Anyway, so uh, yeah, not a bad spot, like it's all right. I don't know if I'm in a bit of doubt my way, I like to camp now or not, but I can't see anyone bothering me. I fuck knows where I am. But yeah, I've um, greatly underestimated how difficult this would be. I'm fucked, but anyway, well, the bike, bike has performed well. Tent, need to put my hair bed up. Um, horse over there, is that a horse? All right, bud. So yeah, there's quite a lot of horse poop on the floor here, so. But hopefully the bike and the tent and that'll freak them out enough to keep them going. Not that mind anyway. Um, right, that's me, done. Not smiling that much anymore. <laughs> but just, um, I'm sure like once, it's, once I'm back home and stuff, it'll um, feel like it was worthwhile, but at the minute I'm just fucked. So uh, at least I don't think I'll have any problems sleeping. Done, so. I've had some food, I got a wrap from the shop, and then I, I might cook some more because I'm just not eating anything bad, I don't, I don't think that's helped, so, but anyway, night night, see you in the morning. Right, morning, right, I made it through the night, um, that was where I was, leaving no trace and all that stuff, but um, yeah, slept kind of shit because it was really windy, and uh, you know, you just, I don't know, just because I'm not used to sleeping out in the dark, I was like, there's definitely something lurking around out here, but um, yeah, there was anyway. <laughs> Where is he? Oh, hello. So these guys, I must have interrupted their nice area. But yeah, so they were lurking around the tent last night. So it wasn't me just thinking it's things that go bump in the night. But um, yeah, a bit of fog and stuff over there. But it looks like some sun just over there. But um, I've got a new plan anyway. I can't face 45 miles of uh, off-road today. So I've planned a new route, which is still going to be very hilly. But um, it's 25 miles, pretty much all on road on the way back. So I'll be doing that. So, uh, if anything exciting on route, I'll get the camera out, but if not, I'll uh, give you a shout when I'm back at the car, and that's it. Right, back on the GoPro again. Um, just stopped off at the river and filled up my water, my, and filtered some water from my water bottle, so I think I should be good for the day now. This path down here was a fucking cunt, so I'm glad I stopped where I did last night. So, there's loads of ruins and stuff, which were great, but it was just like walking down a small river trying to go around and then just couldn't really and then to go back so anyway never mind lovely bridge now so uh head over that and then i am going up this path here i think and then that should hopefully get me back to some sort of um slightly easier pedal roads because my knee is fucked it turns out a new injury not one not one i've ever even had before so that's nice isn't it so, right this is just a video of me moaning about it but um, i am having a good time honestly <laughs> Back again. Oh, there's a load of ponies. You've got to film the ponies. Oh, look at the babies. Hello. Come 
All right. Yep, I'm on my way, don't worry. Carry on eating. Look at you. Oh, <laughs> sorry. All right, bud. Yeah, that's it, no more ponies. All right, so my plan was just to sort of plod on and uh, get some food on the way or something. But I just come down a really fucking steep hill into a little valley, um, which I'm gonna have to pedal out of in a minute, which is gonna be horrible. But anyway, I saw this little spot. Oh, it looks nice, doesn't it? So uh, I got some water, boil that up, and I might as well eat one of these meals that I've uh, been dragging around with me. So yeah, we're getting there. So I'm gonna scoff that. And at least I've got a full belly to tackle this fucking, no doubt, mm, horrible hill with switchbacks, which is what I've just come down to. It'll probably be the same the other side. But. Anyway, at least I can have a nice snack. A little snackette in here. Should we have a look in the, the waterfall and stuff? Very nice. Oop, bird out. Yeah, really nice. Little plunge pool there if it wasn't fucking cold and I could be bothered. Not for me. Right, anyway, I'm going to eat my scoff. Post chili report, as it expected, this hill has been steepest, but this has been for like two miles. So I've just been pushing, pushing up that. So I decided to stop. Take my breath, get my heart rate back down again. Them lights are weird on this. I've definitely got my settings wrong. Enough. Anyway, some cows over here. It's nice though. I'm still out there. Shan't bother the cows, but some sort of a. Uh, Stone circle thing there, it's nice isn't it? It's good for looking at. But um, yeah, I think it's just gonna be a day of this really, like go up hill, which I don't mind. It's, at least it's solid ground and not fucking gravel and mud like yesterday. And then uh, go back down again, which is a fun bit. So anyway, I crack on. Finally made it to the top of that fucking hill. But, um, yeah, it's better isn't it? All like nice and smooth, but it's still like out in it, so. On reflection, maybe should have just done roads instead of trying to do the off-road thing. Cause you still see a lot. Um, yeah, so anyway, I'm going down some hills now, so probably have to go up some more in a bit, but it's all good. Right, still fucking going. So I've done 10 miles today. Oh, just coming up 10 miles. So I've got 16 miles to go back to Hampton. It's been, uh, yeah, loads of hills. So at least this isn't too bad. I can pedal up this. It's still it's just steady, steady away. But we're still it's still so it's really nice out here. Got another tour up there. Don't know which one it is. Can't bother to look at a map. Big pile of stones. Old. Um, so I'm going along. I don't know if you can make out on this. There's a path there. Oh sorry, path. The road that goes along there, and then uh, uh, up and it skirts around the bottom of that big mound over there so i can see where i've got to go which is both good and bad i suppose but um yeah sun's out though these roads are all right yeah the odd car but everyone's going slow it's nice i think this is definitely um if i was going to do it again i would fuck off the um the off-road bit and just like find these nice roads so so we've got a couple of sheep in the road up here to navigate that'll be the next excitement so yeah all good on we go. I counted a local gang. All right. How are you? How's the grass? Good grass. <laughs> hey, it's the top of that climb. Got some hiding cows. Everybody's favourite. Yeah. Hey guys. So, I'm hoping now I've got quite a long, it looks like I've got a nice long sweeping downhill, so that would be nice. But my fucking ass and knees are hurting, so anyway. So, that was good, got to get on that quite quick. But, more ponies. Hey guys. A bit modelling. Oh yeah, good modelling. <laughs> right, still going down. Probably means I'm gonna have to go back up again, but hey. 
Oh, I'm coming down into uh, Changford now, I think it is. Oh, switch it up for handlebar cam. Can I can I switch this mid-record? No, I can't. Anyway, turn it on. So it's been, uh, oh, I don't know how many miles now, just like these like nice B-road sort of stuff. Those trees, not many cars. Like that's the first car I've seen that's gone past then. One guy on a bike that was on the wrong side of the road who looked fucking a bit weird and nearly uh, crashed into me. But um, anyway, a bit of downhill now, so that'd be nice. It's been a long uphill again. We're flying, knocking out the miles. Going downhill. So, um, nice, but I, I bet there's going to be some uphill in a bit. I'm going over some water. Ah! So, drop right down to the bottom now. Leveled out, so I'll probably be going uphill. There's a sign back there saying road closed. I'm hoping that just means the cars and I can get through. Because it could be shit if I end up pedaling up a load of fucking hill and then have to stop and turn around. But we'll see what happens when we come to it. Okay, so we're back to uh, we're back to pushing again. It's a steep hill this one, so but I got ten miles to go, so that's not so bad. We'll get there. Hmm. So it does say road closed. Maybe I'll just walk up a bit and see how it looks. We'll see. Okay, so. No sign reason why it should be closed yet, but this hill is fucking steep. <laughs> if, if I've come this for no reason, I'll be real sad. <laughs> this might be the fucking look at that fucking steep. It's not the really steepest one so far. Maybe we'll just close it because it's too steep. <laughs> anyway, what we got? Nine marks. <laughs> so bad news. <laughs> There was a guy cutting down a tree and he was being a fucking dick. So can I squeeze past? Nah, he's having none of it. So uh, anyway, so I go back down this hill and I'll try to find a way around. I'm really glad it was pushed up that massive fucking steep hill. Never mind. I'm sure I'll find another way around. Okay, so I found a way around and it was the hill was even steeper than that one that I videoed in the last one. No point video and yet me panting going up another hill. So I'm going down a hill now. And I assume I will probably have to go back up again in a bit. Because this is steep as fuck. Ah. Okay, so that's, the detour was a fucking pain in the ass in the end. Turned out it was just no easy way, so it's up and down hills for miles and miles and miles. Anyway, sort of back on track now, but it's just been slow going, just so up and down, but it's just how it is. So I've stopped here. Because I've got eight miles to go, I've got no snacks left. But I can't be asked cooking one of my meals, so I'm gonna have this beer that I didn't drink last night because I couldn't face it. This beer's got calories in it, isn't it? How many calories we got? 200 calories. That'll get me eight miles, won't it? So, cheers, eight miles. Hmm. Oh. Feel invigorated by that beer. But, um, hopefully, I'll numb my knee and my bum a little bit. I can push on with the last seven miles or whatever it is now. So, but more, more going uphill. At least this bit's pedalable. It's still fucking steep though. But um, we're cracking on. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure it'll. Um, Tomorrow, or in a couple of days, we'll be like, ah, oh, it was A-star. I feel like anything, isn't it? Like when you have a hangover, I suppose. When, um, yeah, yeah, it's a good time, I'll do it again, despite all the pain. <laughs> so we've had to revert to getting slit not on the headphones to, uh, to juice things up a bit. Whoa, where am I going here? Am I going up? 
We got it at five miles. Five miles. Let's go. I did it. Finally back at Oakhampton train station where I left my car. That climb back up from fucking Oak, I thought, ah, oh, mile ago, not bad. From Oakhampton to the train station, the climb's fucking brutal. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I'm back in the fucking car finally. Don't know what to think at the minute. I think I enjoyed it. I'm just fucked. But um, yeah. <laughs> Good to do these things, isn't it? I shall uh, give my deeper thoughts on the matter a bit later when I've eaten and stuff. Yeah.